Hello everybody. We're here again at a New York State Department of Environmental Conservation campground. This one is at Bear Spring Mountain, not far from Roscoe, New York. We're gonna be here for the weekend and I've got the extra pleasure of having my dog Bella with me and my wife is gonna meet us up here tomorrow. So we're up here to do an early setup. I have the kayak again and uh, we're in Site 13 today. We're gonna be setting up and getting ready for Shallon's arrival the tomorrow. Next stop is We're here. Left. Bear Spring Mountain Campground and Day Use Area. We're here. Here at Site 13 at Bear Spring Mountain Campground. I got Bella with me today. She has got herself completely tangled in the picnic table. And I've only been here about three minutes. Good job, Bella. Standard DEC fire pit, of course. Beautiful site. Kind of water going all around us. Which is neat and a nice brand new wooden picnic table well time to get set up thanks everyone for joining us today we're doing a little bit of DEC camping it's another weekend camp out I brought the family along my wife's coming up tomorrow my my pet Bella is here right now I'm not I'm sure she's probably okay drinking this water but don't drink too much Bell I'll get you some fresh all right, we'll be back. Setup is next. Okay, so that's your basic setup. It's a little dicey to do on your own. It's a matter of getting everything laid out and then you kind of work it up into the position that you wanted it. Hey, Bella, what you doing down there? Don't have too much fun. <laughs> All right, so part number one is up. I want to reinforce these. Maybe run a line from here over to the tree. Free up some of this space. But it's not bad. Now we're gonna put big blue over here. Yeah, you better shake off whatever crawled on you down there. Are you all caught up? <laughs> okay, you're free. Okay, you're free. Well, that's your basic setup. I have to peg it down and put on the fly, put on some guy lines for safety. Uh, since the last time I used this at Little Pond, I set it up in the backyard. I gave it a disinfecting and a cleaning, and I used some WD-40 on all the connections so they would move real nice, and it helped. It went up nice and easy. I'll finish it off. I'll be right back. Oh, hi, everybody. I'm sitting here at site number 13 at Bear Spring Mountain Campground. It's a Department of Environmental Conservation campground in the Catskill Mountains. We're near the town of Downsville, New York. We're all set up. Give you a quick pan of the campground. Bella's taking a nap in front of Big Blue. 
I've got my tarp set up over the picnic table. And look, I've got a, a fancy cover on the picnic table. My wife is coming up tomorrow, so broke out all the stops and made it real nice for her. I'm cooking a piece of chicken over some slow coals. It's about 7.20 on day one. We're all set up. It was a very long night for Bella and I. The first half of the night went well enough, but about 2, 2.30 in the morning, it started to rain and it poured. Luckily, nothing really collapsed or failed. The only minor failure, which probably worked out for my benefit, was this small pole, it's my smallest, lightest duty pole. I put this on the low corner so the water would drain. I had it up a little too high so it kind of self-regulated and dropped down and stopped it from crashing. So I'm pretty happy with how that worked. We had a nice piece of chicken for dinner last night. We ate late, it's normal for a setup day. And uh, I remember about 2.30 in the morning, I woke up and I looked for Bella, I couldn't find her. And we are in a tent, by the way, how would she get out? She was underneath my cot, hiding from the lightning and thunder, the poor thing. It was pretty loud and the rain was pretty loud too, so you know, we were up most of the night till maybe 4.30, 5 o'clock, and then we were able to sleep a little bit longer. And she is walking in the mud. And I guess she's done with being in the tent, so I don't care if she wants to walk in the mud. That's all right with me. Huh? You having fun, little Bella? It's been a tough night, huh? I mean, she'll probably take a nice long nap today. Water is flowing. You have fresh water, by the way. Have fun. My coffee's on. I brought the Fold and Go propane stove and a, a one pound tank just to make life easy. Okay, I'm gonna get my coffee going. I'll be right back. Okay, this is the morning of day two. We're at Bear Spring Mountain Campground in Downsville, New York. Right across the way is the public swimming area. It looks like the boat launch. This is Launch Pond. I think I'm saying that right. And this is a bit of a, I guess, a, a dam. A lot of rain last night. Lots and lots of water. Oh, puppy, let's go. This is all day use area, picnic areas. Although I am starting to see campground signs. This is campsite 19. Right on the lake. What a beauty. Number five. The numbers jump around here. It's another nice sight right on the lake. Stay. Stay. You're not allowed on the public beach. But we could take a quick picture of it from here. Across the way is the uh, kayak and boat rentals and the dressing room. Mm -hmm. Come on, Belle. Come on. Let's go. This is a nice wide shot of the day use area. The lakes in the background, the composting toilet, and the playground are in the foreground. We've done that as a stage and amphitheater for performances. Cute little playground in the shape of a Winnebago. Bella wants to go play, but she's not allowed. No, Bella. Hey, this is the composting toilet system they use here because it's so close to the lake. It's more environmentally conscious. It's better for water pollution and such. Very interesting. Come, Bella. Good girl. Hey, welcome to Bear Spring Mountain Campground and Day Use Area. It is beautiful here. Bella likes it.
dogs aren't allowed in the picnic areas or at the public beach. But it looks like this bench is safe. It looks dry. Pretty spot on here, Bella. You can sit. Can you give Daddy a hug? Hi, Mommy. Can't wait till you get here. Okay. <laughs> hi, baby. Hi. Hi. Good girl. Hi. Hello. Huh? He's a good girl. Hi. Super baby. Hi. I missed you. <sighs> You can tell mommy all about the storm in the middle of the night. Oh, the rain. Did it rain for you? Oh, my goodness. Yeah. It's thunder and lightning. What a good girl. What a good girl you are, yes. <laughs> That's a welcome for camp. This wood? You're allowed to walk through here? Drive through here, I mean? I hope so. <laughs> well, if they didn't want you to drive through, they wouldn't have made it wide enough to drive through. Mm -hmm. They wouldn't have put signs that said five miles an hour. I guess we wouldn't get the trailer through here. I don't think so. No. The Downsville Covered Bridge. Well, we've seen it now. Hi everybody, we're still here at Bear Spring Mountain, camping at a DEC campground. It's, let's see, Thursday, Friday, this will be day three for me. Sharon's up visiting, so I'm not solo camping for a change. Just ran into town, got some firewood and a few things. Now we're going to take a walk with Bella. It was a short uphill walk up the bridle path, as it's uh, labeled on the map as a bridle path. This is what we found. Top of a hill. It looks like they might have burned some yard waste, you know, when they did a spring cleanup possibly. It must have been something. It was a nice walk with Bella. That's where we came from. And all this wood laying about. Right down there. That water feel about. Hmm? All right, the downside to Site 13 is that you're at the top of the hill, so every time you come home, you're tired. But it is private. There's a view of a campsite. Had just enough room to fit the cars in. 
and that's the road we have to come home. It's a tough one. Uh, you get your exercise here. Just a quick wrap up on day three. Um, spent the day in camp for the most part, just went out for a supply run. We ran into the town of Downsville, beautiful little town. We picked up some firewood and a few supplies and came right back to camp, took Bella for a walk down to the pond. She went for a swim. Uh, that was a lot of fun. It's a beautiful pond. We checked out a few campsites along the way. I don't think I got them all. It's a weekend again, so it's hard to get all the campsites, but I'm doing what I can when I see an empty one, I grab it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I want to say thank you for watching. If you're new to the channel, please hit the subscription button. If you have any comments, leave them below. Love to hear from you. Don't forget to leave a like and share with your friends. Just a quick update on day four. I'm sharing my home today, so I spent the day in camp, just hanging out by the campfire, had a nice breakfast. Took Bella for a nice walk and packed them up and sent them on their way. It's Sunday night. I'm gonna spend the night here and break down tomorrow and head home. It was a great stay here. Basically, I have no neighbors from here all the way around to there. Those nice people moved in a couple days ago. Beautiful place, water running around us the whole time. Great sound. This is my view. I could sit here for days. And I have. Okay, we're getting near sunset on day four. We just got to take a walk down to the pond, see what was going on. It's always a beautiful scene down here. And I know I've shot this area a couple of times since I've been here, but it keeps drawing me back. It's got one of the best views of the pond. This is where the pond drains down into the creek. Look at this view. Just spectacular. It's Sunday night, around 6.30ish. Just had a nice dinner last night in camp. Sharon and Bella went home. Sharon has to work in the morning. So I'm gonna get up in the morning, break down, and head on home. It's a great place to be. Right across the way is the public beach, the boat rentals. There's a little changing area, a fishing pier. Everything you're supposed to see in a beautiful Catskill weekend. 72 and sunny all day today. And three beautiful days. And one night of rain. Not a bad deal. Okay, it's day five, Monday, on our trip to Bear Spring Mountain, DEZ Campground. Obviously, we are headed home. We're all packed up. It is two minutes after 11, so I am no longer a guest in this spot. Now, this is Site 13. Highly recommend it. You can get a small RV in here. I was talking to Sharon, if you had a toy hauler here, think of what the back deck would be like. This is what your view would be. Yeah, it'd be beautiful. A little scary though, kind of high on a hill. So everything's all cleaned up, the truck is all packed. I've got a garbage run on the way out, recycling. Everything is strapped down securely. The boat's not used on this trip. The cool weather kept us at camp. Sharon came up with Bella and that was a lot more fun than kayaking. It's a nice little pond, but you know, I don't think I missed anything. A beautiful campground. If you are in Sullivan County and looking for a really nice family campground, this is the place. It's in the, uh, if you go to the New York State Department of Environmental Conservation website, you'll find it. Bear Spring Mountain. Okay, thanks again for watching. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscription button in the corner to turn on notifications so I can contact you next time I upload a video. If you enjoyed this content, give us a thumbs up. It really helps the channel to grow. Leave a comment below if you have any questions. Love to hear from you. G. Charles.